after the leads become familiar with you, a percentage of them are going to answer your phone call the next time you call, or they're going to come out in the lobby and they're gonna shake your hand next time you stop by. And that is when you move that prospect forward to the DM handshake. It doesn't matter if it's phone, it doesn't matter if it's field, it works the same way either way. When you get to meet a decision maker, you're going to give them your who, who, what statement. The who you are, the who you serve, your avatar, and what you do for your avatar. Please go watch this training video I did for you. This one right here, if you execute what I teach you right here, you will schedule more appointments with more decision makers than anything else you've ever tried to do before. And I dare say that for the first time, you might not be super duper nervous about meeting a decision maker. This is where the objections typically come in. And if you'll watch the Stop Overcoming Objections video that will also link here for you, oh my goodness gracious, y'all, just in three of the first eight steps, I just about will guarantee you, for most of you, we have doubled, if not tripled, your earnings already. And we're just getting started. Your objective of the handshake is to get a yes or a no. Yes, based on me being your avatar and I have desire for the what you do, I will meet with you Tuesday morning at nine o'clock. And then here's the wild thing. If you want to understand how to get decision makers to actually schedule appointments that they keep, focus on your avatar plus desire instead of focusing on how to overcome their objections. Truly game changer right there.